On December 3rd, 1773, the merchant ship Eleanor docked at Griffin's Wharf alongside the Dartmouth. Carrying 250 tons of taxed tea in its hold, it increased the volume of the controversial cargo in Boston by over 200%. Like that of the Dartmouth, Eleanor's tea was not unloaded upon arrival. In fact, John Rowe, owner of the vessel, suggested a creative way of relieving it. Referring to the tea as that detestable and obnoxious commodity, he wondered aloud whether salt water would not make a good tea as fresh. His question would soon be answered later that month when the contents of the Dartmouth, Eleanor, and soon arriving Beaver were landed, uh, watered, landed in water.